uh, innocence in a lot of ways, but uh, my God, uh, uh, a massive transition in our country, for sure, not only culturally, politically, uh, in every possible way. I mean, my God, the- Yeah, free love, peace. Um, people landing on the moon, for hope, God's sakes. <laughs> hope, the vision of the future, and, and for all that, you know, it, it, 69 certainly was, was um, that came crashing down. And I remember my parents, who are still sort of hippies to this day, talking about this sort of era in history and, and the Manson murders being that loss of innocence, the loss of everything sort of hopes and aspirations and dreams of a new America sort of all being encapsulated by this real moment of, of heinous evil. And so that's why it's fascinating. And I think that what Tarantino does in this movie is he, it's his homage to Hollywood in a lot of ways. And he puts you in the, in, you're voyeuristically looking through this world through the eyes of two working class guys, one being a sort of, down and out actor that has, uh, whose uh, expiration date has sort of happened and his, as a result, his, his, uh, his stunt, his, 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 his uh, stunt man who's, you know, struggling as well to live and we're watching this whole world and uh, unfold and change right before our very eyes. Mm -hmm. mm. Nice. It's absolutely true. I, I think that, you know, we were given so much wealth and backstory of our, of our characters. And that's why we, we so easily sort of fit into the roles the first day we were there. Because not only do we have all these reference points, but we, he gave us a chronological history of our lives together, what Rick could have been, and as a result, what Cliff could have been, and what haunts the insecurity that haunts my character, this, this idea that there's always something more and he's never going to achieve it. Will he achieve it? And this constant insecurity and regret that he has. But I love the, the channeling that, that Tarantino has of seeing the, these sort of pearly gates of Hollywood being next door to us. But we, we're voyeurs. We're within and without. We're, we don't belong. And that's his entrance into...